Welcome back. Next week at Coney County Schools, we'll see a new addition, thanks to taxpayers. The Coney County Sheriff's Office has announced there'll be a resource officer in all 18 Coney schools. That's right, Fox Carolina's Carrie Weimer is live at the school district office there. So, Carrie, pretty uh, interesting thing here. I'm sure a lot of parents happy to see this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, the Oconee County School District was not one of the districts that were going to receive state funding to have the school resource officers. But the superintendent told me today, thanks to the community and taxpayers, they will have the officers next week when school starts. New faces will greet Oconee County students this school year. It started with the school shootings uh, nationally. Uh, there was much concern uh, across our country, but certainly here in Oconee County as well, um, about school students being protected. And there were quite a few people in Oconee County who were outspoken about the need to have an SRO in every one of our schools. Governor Henry McMaster said in his State of the State address, in light of recent school violence, he wanted more resource officers in public schools. The state responded with a $2 million budget, but schools would have to meet certain requirements. The state has something called the Index of Taxpaying Ability that does literally rank school districts in order of ability to pay. That's not necessarily the wealth of the students or the families in that school district, but it's the wealth of the community. The superintendent said because Oconee County is wealthy in taxpayers, the school did not meet the requirement to be state funded. Uh, county council funded several positions and our school board funded several positions. So now between the county government and the school district budget, uh, we're funded. 18 positions in Oconee County. Every elementary, middle, and high school in Oconee County will see a new face next week. We're excited about this year, 2019. There's going to be an uh, officer in every school. Lieutenant Lyle says a resource officer's job is to make sure everyone arrives safely and leaves safely. It's really sad that, we, that it's come to this because of the amount of violence that, that it's, it's facing our country um, in the last couple months, but um, it's a deterrent for anybody wanting to think that way. The school district is looking forward to the new additions. It's encouraging to see the positive relationship that we have between our students and our school resource officers. They do an excellent job of just being real with the kids. Now over 60 school districts applied for that funding in the state. However, only 38 received it. Live in Oconee County, Carrie Weimer, Fox Carolina, The 5 O'Clock News.